Thought I was the only one who bunked off down here. I'm unemployed. I ain't got nothing to bunk off from. Something will turn up. I ain't qualified, Jamie. Washing glasses. Even that's a million miles away. Dad always said I should have stayed on at school. No. You're fine as you are. At least you can still be bothered to talk to me. You and Sonia falling out? I'm not good enough for her anymore. No, I'm not. She's moving on. And I can't keep up. No idea. Right, well, I better go and have a look in the arches again. I'm surprised you've got the time to go looking for Jamie. What with all your college work. Sorry? Well, from what I've heard, you haven't got five minutes these days. No. Well, I did give up quite a lot. Carry on studying. Don't want to blow it, do I? No. So long as you remember where you come from and who your real friends are. I'm here, and I? Jamie's not stupid, you know. What are you going on about? He told me about last night. What? The way he showed me up? Ah, you and this Graham making him wait and then turning up together. He knows something's going on, you know. Graham. I don't fancy Graham. I used to know what went on in Sonia's head. You know, me and her, we could talk about anything. Do you reckon I embarrass her? No. Not unless you're doing it on purpose. They go back to the yard, she feels gonna go off his head. Back to reality, eh? Yep. Yeah. Stinks, doesn't it? Yeah. Bye then. All right, Zoe? Watch out! Be lucky! You're a good listener, Zoe. That's what friends are for. Everything will work out. For both of us, yeah? Thank you.